Welcome to the Amazing Race Capsum Edition. Five competitive teams will be racing to become the next best sensor manufacturing company over the next eight years. Good luck to all the teams. Our first challenge awaits us up in the computer lab. On your marks, get set, go! Your products to the best of your ability on Capset. Good luck. We really need to pay attention to the problem with the sales budget because it affects the customer's awareness and accessibility. I just don't know what to put for these numbers. The I have no clue. I don't know. Okay, go. Hey, it's just Capset race. It's not a big deal. Congratulations on your balanced scorecard. You received 20 out of 20 points on average for your sales per employee. Oh yeah! <laughs> According to your success measures, you received 5.5 out of 10 points for your return on sales. Your next challenge is to finance your R&D, marketing, and production decisions. Make sure to avoid big out. I just don't know what to produce. I don't know what numbers to put in. I don't know. Chief, listen. To figure out our forecasting, we'll take what we sold last year for low tech multiplied by 10 percent, for the high tech by 20 percent, and just go from there for production. I don't know. I just, I just don't know what to produce. I don't want to produce too much and have high inventory costs and then visit Big Al, but I just don't want to produce if too little and stock out. If you're afraid of getting loans and stuff like that, we can always issue stock. Our stock is too low. We, we can't issue stock. It won't help us. Gee, you need to calm down. Let's take half some race. received an emergency loan in round two and round three, and it totaled to $39 million. You received a zero out of 20 on your balance scorecard because of this. It's partially due to poor sales forecasting and partially due to high inventory carrying costs. This is gonna hurt you and set you back in future rounds because you will be restricted on how much you can reinvest in your company. I just don't know where to do. Uh, we're, you're going to lose. I don't know. Jake, I don't know. Okay, listen. We just need to focus on more accurate sales forecasting, take our long-term debt, and pay back the emergency loan, and then cover our cash position to cover our expenses. I, I just don't know. We're just going to lose. Jake, calm down. It's just cash and race. About time, Team Yuri, you're the last team to cross the finish line. This means you are officially kicked off of the Amazing Capsum Race. No! Jake, for the last time, it's just the Capsum Race! <laughs> On our second leg of the race, we were forced to take out two big loans from Big Al. This caused us to get a 5.5 out of 14 on cumulative profits for our success measures. This was due to high forecasting. For, unfortunately, we were unable to make up our lost cause because we fell too far behind because of this. Yeah, we started doing well in the later rounds, but it was just too late. According to our analyst report, our contribution margin increased ever since round three, earning us 20 points in round three, 40 points in round four, 60 points in round five, and 100 points in six and seven. Something for our wealth creation. In round one, we started out with 80 points, then fell to 20 points in round two, then fell farther down to 10 points in round three. From then on out, we increased our wealth creation by 20 points every round for the next five years. However, all this is too late and we came in last. 